Yeah. So all the horses are about to die of starvation because nobody is feeding them anything. I knew this was going to happen. I can't make kibble. I can't make kibble. We've tried. And I don't think we can even make kibble in enough time to stop them dying. Well, it is going to be free meat, but I'd rather not lose the horses right now. The adults in particular. You can give them regular simple meals. Right, how do we do that? Because I need to feed them quickly. If we allow simple meal to come here. You can give them rice or potato as well. Do we have rice? We do have rice. Well, it's set to preferred, so in theory they'll move some stuff there, won't they? Let's make it critical and then they get on with it now. If I open the gate, they're going to run away. I was told that the animals will eat from shelves, but I guess we're going to find out. Right, so a bit too fast is moving a food, moving some food over here. Let's see what happens. Oh, hey, oh, hey, hello, Bosh. <laughs> That was like a massive race. <laughs> Whoosh. We're starving. <laughs> well, I think that answers the question. <laughs> They're actually 48% food now. That's good. This is where our uh, pawns die now because we haven't got enough food for ourselves. Right, listen here, horses. I'm just saying, if it comes to it, you're all dying. <laughs> you can eat our meals, but if we run out of meals, we're eating you. That's the order. Deal with it. I don't know how many meals they're going to actually put out here. That is actually connected, it's just covered in grass so I can't see it. Right, so there's no solo, we've got the wind turbine going. And we are... To actually charging up bizarrely. Right, so we have an art bench. Wait, who's new lovers? Oh god. Enceladus tried to flirt with Boeing by impishly questioning her fashion knowledge. Boeing was attracted and is now Enceladus's lover. Enceladus and Boeing now want to sleep together. 
consider making a double bed. I have no control over this, so you know, it is what it is. Well, that frees up a room. We'll get Alex to make him a, a double bed. I would make you a royal bed, but I don't have any gold. So I can't make you a VIP bed. I'm sorry. Meanwhile, add a bill. Make a small sculpture. What does that say? 50 log. 100, 400, jeez, man. Let's make, like, some sculptures and then sell them. What do you think? Who's our most, um, skilled... What do you need for sculpture? Artistic, presumably. One, five from Bria. Eight from Bit Too Fast. We can go with four or eight. So it's not five or eight. So let's make it five. And then one of them can hopefully get around to doing it. So we'll say minimum level is five. Don't make ten. Why not? I don't know how much they're going to sell for. They're only small sculptures. Uh, we could use silver, which I'm not going to. We could use steel, which I have plenty of. We have a lot of wood. We just make wooden sculptures. It takes a long time. Oh dear. Also, we need to bring in the art thing. A bit too fast and... There you go. I mean, I don't think Bria's going to do it because Bria's mostly focused on research, I think. But a bit too fast may get around to it if he's not crafting or hauling or cooking. <laughs> Ain't nobody got time for art, I don't think. I'm enjoying it, Backlash. Not enjoying having a stupid cold, though. Right, what's the wildlife situation? Alpaca. Injured. Whoa. Surely Alex can finish that one off. Have you lost a colony yet? No. No, I'm glad to say I haven't. Where's that come from? Interesting. The solar's almost at full. And it's not charging the batteries. I think we need more solar. We need more power gen, basically. Double bed is ready. <laughs> hey, here we go. Set owner. Enceladus. And Boeing. Boeing is going, Enceladus is a collector. It doesn't matter if they're critical or not, does it? 
in all honesty. Because the food won't go off when it's there anyway. Your wife is watching. Bowen, I don't make the rules. I did say to you. I did say to you when I name your characters, I have no control over them. This is the nature of the game. You're in there with Boeing, whether you like it or not. You can also put the bed. Oh, that's a good idea, actually. Make two medical beds. Probably a better use for it. Bree is shuffling paper around. Um, I could give Benner a bit too fast to run room. I want to finish this wall off, really, if we're doing construction. Trouble is, Alex is so busy hunting, he's not really doing construction. And we need we need to hunt because we need the clothing, basically. They've almost all got decent winter clothes on. I kind of want to finish this off, though. I take it they're now active. Sal one is pregnant. Well, that didn't take long. I've not really considered what they're going to eat yet, to be honest. We probably need to feed them something. You have a free roam. Where are you getting that from? of your enemies. Where are you seeing this? Oh, you mean his food? Yeah, they've not been attacked for a while. And the, the problem is I don't really think they've got anything to eat right now. So what do we uh, what do we feed them? I think we're gonna have to put some kind of storage in there again. Put a, um, a small shelf. They're, but that grass is not going to last forever, is it? Assuming they are eating it, which I'm not sure they are. Well, I did consider letting them go in here, but I wasn't sure if that would be okay. Like, will the horses and the pigs not really get along? I don't know. Non-ideal temperature, temperature growth multiplies 68%. That is actually growing, though, that hay. Well, if I could put them in the same pen, we well just hold that open. Let them roam around. There you go. We've now got 4.9 kilowatts of excess power from this. That'll charge that up nicely. Right, the gate's open. Shelf's built. Let me just sort out what you can put here. I'll just say nothing for now, because I don't think we need to use it yet. I 
I would really like it if Bray could finish researching the um, Devil Strand before the winter ends. That would be great. No, I don't think they do, Dusty. That was quick. You just stepped outside. <laughs> Yeah, so geothermal power you have to you have to research down here. Mr. Squirrel just went out and got me some lockets. <laughs> but right now we're doing Devil Strand just so that we can grow that and make our own like cloth cotton. Cause I figured worst case scenario we need to start making clothing and we can sell them. Sell clothing and stuff. So we can actually trade properly. Carpet making. Oh, wow. I wonder if you can sell the carpet. We have beautiful carpets from cloth. So you can put carpet down in the room. Make different colored rooms. That is fantastic. If we do machining, we can make frag grenades. And from that, we can do gunsmithing and make our own bolt-action rifles. Boeing's playing chess with himself. <laughs> uh, yeah, it's doing pretty well so far, Zero. Still getting used to it. Yeah, Techie, Techie Nick, I'm so looking forward to moving corpses into this area and letting the pigs feast. Well, they're getting well fed. Well, that one is. Wasn't one of them pregnant? There you go. Early stage. expired don't care it's minus eight outside no i don't think they ever did mine the silver i think it's because alex is still working through the animal priority these Unconscious. banner go and get it right i'm going to see if alex wants to do a bit of mining hauling 38 silver so he got 38 silver out of one square then it's not bad What do you mean, Cyan? Uh, 
<sighs> We're gonna have to do it. Oh, there's a cougar here. It is squirrel side, it really is. Oh my god. I thought he was shooting that then. I was like, what are you doing? It's a guinea pig and he's shooting it with a rifle. That noise it just made. <laughs> Wait, what's this? What's this? A vagabond? What did he... We can feed it to the pigs. Hang on, strip him. I see pig food, that's what I see. It's pickles from yesterday. <laughs> It's not fully rotted out. Hang on, how do we um, tell him where to put him? Where is he going to put? I don't know where he's going to put him. He might put him in the freezer. I think we said no to corpses, didn't we? Human-like corpses, no. So it won't go in the freezer. I genuinely don't know where he's going to take him. Oh, he's going to the uh, the dumping stockpile zone. So I'm guessing what we need to do is create a zone in here or something. And say, this is a dumping stockpile zone for corpses. So we clear that. Allow large corpses and dead bodies. Humanoid. Animal, no, because we probably want to do something with them. Allow rotten. I don't know if pigs, if pigs eat rotting corpses, I, that may not. It may not go down well, I don't know. Maybe we shouldn't allow rotten there. But then they're not fresh either, are they? I don't even know if they're going to eat it, if I'm honest. Right, we need to turn that off. Let's say no to humans. No, you were just told you can't put that there, mate. Let's see what happens. It says desiccated. See, I'm thinking... I'm thinking that one's beyond redemption. I don't think the, uh, the pigs are going to go for this. <laughs> we should probably bury that thing. <laughs> I think we had a grave down here somewhere, didn't we? Is it there? There's one grave.
Yeah, we don't want them to see it. Like, the normal people won't see that, but I'm going to move it in a second. So he's got these constant debuffs. Extremely comfortable. Look at that. This place is so cushy. Look at that. It's getting colder. Yeah, but the low expectation thing is coming down slowly over time. It's like an, a, an early game buff. It used to be on 24. Right, I kind of think I want... We're missing granite blocks. Give me a break. Right, that's why they're doing it. It's because they already have enough granite blocks. I can't finish the wall because we stopped making blocks because... Actually, if we do that first, make granite and then make any. There we go. He's on it. That's why the wall never got done. A break in the production chain. to move this I can't do anything with it I can't right click on this so if I say don't allow rock Will he suddenly get moved? Yes. Interesting mechanic, that. I like how it leaves the little tombstone there. That's great. I just saw him going out cleaning dirt.
Yeah, it's because the reason they go outside cleaning the dirt is because it's classed as the home area. So if they put down a piece of wall, it automatically builds like a home area around it, and then they go out and clean it. You can turn it off. There's an option down here to turn it off. Oh. I reckon if you'd have put the rabbit there, I reckon that uh, pig would have eaten it. These batteries never get fully charged during the day, I've noticed. I think it's a winter thing. Uh, Step Sailor, thank you for four months. Hawk, thank you for 27. That was meant for here. Message wasted, K. Kenders. I missed that 25 months resub of yours. My bad. Bria's 75% research. Travel mare is pregnant. What a surprise. These are getting bigger. What age do they have to be to be considered an adult? Actually, let somebody have that. We could put Banner in it all a bit too fast in it. Yeah, they've all got their own pad now. Can I? <coughs> Excuse me. Hundred and twenty nine simple meals left. Yeah, we should go trading again. I think we need to buy components. Maybe we should trade somewhere else. Maybe we should go there. It's a bit of a longer journey though. We've been to that one, but I've not been to that one yet. Show what we'll buy. Oh, that's quite handy. We could go and sell them a horse. We can't get rid of the stallion, he's only eight years old. It's a young male horse. A young female horse. That's the one that keeps breeding, I think. Yep. So I can't call a travel mare anymore because... Wait, can you... Can you ride on a young horse if you go out? Like a 15-day-old horse, or are they too young to ride? If you go trekking? Does it have to be a, um, a mature one? Eight-day-old. You have to have them trained to be able to ride them. Is that why they... Is that why Alex didn't sit on it? 
and just dragged it along because they never got trained tameness so they're already tamed horse trainability none guard The animal will randomly haul items from time to time, though it can't be directed to haul specific items. Well, that, to me, tells me that I can't use them to haul unless I train them. Riding animals is a mod, not vanilla. So when you trek somewhere, it's no point taking a horse. At all. Unless you've either got the mod to ride them, or you train them to haul. Is that right? Because when I travel across the road, it seemed to be quicker than what it said, which implied that you did ride the horse. But it's all very confusing. Middle stage. Hang on, this is a pig. This is going to give Berta like a litter, isn't it? Now, a horse can be loaded as a pack animal for a caravan. Right. Oh, dear. Right, in that case... Are oh, you pregnant as well? Are you serious? Is it me or has it gone really misty? What's this? Fog? I wonder how fog affects things. Maybe what we should do is make a couple of statues and then go and trade them. Fog effect shooting accuracy. That's interesting. Well, this part of the base is now secure. The kill zone is now finished. And the top corner of the map is about to get finished as well. And then we're relatively secure again. Even more misses. Hmm. Let's see how long it takes to make a sculpture. Crafting and hauling. Right, let's see if we can get a bit too fast to make something. Making a small sculpture. Here he goes. That's 70 units of work left, is it? Oh no, 320 units of work. Blimey. This better be good. Well, I built an extra solar panel. We seem to have a good supply of electricity as it is. Oh, hang on, we can watch Alex's accuracy in the fog. Ha <laughs> ha. 
It's not great in the fog, is it? <laughs> Alex may just... Oh, there's no granite blocks. That's why he's gone hunting. What the heck was that? He shot a boom rat and it exploded. Is that what just happened? <laughs> so if you shoot a boom rat, it starts a fire basically. That's amazing. them for fuel so later on we might want to keep boom rats and breed them but if you get a lightning strike and it hits a boom rat the whole pack is just going to explode that could be hilarious Can you imagine that boom rats can't be milked boomalopes can Ah, uh, okay. So it's a boomalope thing. Did boomalopes explode as well? <laughs> oh my god. There's just more and more hidden depth to this game. I've not even gotten to the fuel side of things. Looks like the fog's gone. It's cold but clear. That's weird. You would have thought the power. Power output is 1700 watts. You would have thought that varied through the day as the sun came up. Wow, it does take a while this, doesn't it? Blimey. How much does a sculpture sell for? Because it takes forever to make. We're not making a helmet because we don't have enough steel. Requires 40 metal. Are you telling me that that boom rat did that? Yeah, exactly. A boom rat basically did that. It started a fire and in comes the rain. But one boom rat did that.
Let's focus him on mining for a bit. I think we've got enough animals. Why is Boeing the only one without a decent coat? He's got blue fur pants on, I suppose. Let's make one right now. Nice. I'm not so much chest plane. Finished re uh, Devil Strand, nice. Exceptionally tough, heat resistant plant fiber. Cool. Right, so this. Oh, you went and head into potatoes anyway. I was going to put Devil Strand there, but that's okay. Um, we'll do it here. All of this is. I'm wondering if this is fertile ground under here. Like, if we remove them, will that be fertile underneath? Serious. Devil's got requires a skill of ten. I did not know that when I researched it. The highest we've got is six point four. Oh, that sucks. To go cotton instead. That was pointless doing Devil Strand. Plant medicine. Yeah, it could do. We could put medicine on the top bit. Plate armor. Caravan is approaching. Wait, aren't they from the place I was going to send a caravan to? Let's 
trying to work out how to get in. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. They just walk straight through the stone gate. Like, just completely ignore the rules. That's fine. Um, have you finished making that sculpture? There's meatloaf. Right, so a foal will get $142 if we sell it. A pregnant horse will get 355 A male will get 264 Good to know. They have components. I'm going to buy them. No, we don't have a statue. If we buy all the components, it's going to clean us out. But we can mine some more silver, I think. What's an advanced component? We do have sculptures, do we? We didn't make them. Did, did we make them? I thought he was making wooden wooden uh, wooden sculptures, not sandstone ones. Oh, well, we can have them. Read them before you sell them. Oh, God. Sandstone sculpture. Author. Bit too fast. It's also a sized piece of material sculpted in an artistic form. Red Raider. On this carving is an image of an impressive rock trailing blue flames shredding rocks and debris as it flies. Alex looks on with excitement. The horizontal structure of the image almost conflicts with his neoclassical style. Though few would expect it, the lower part of the image is dominated by a terrorist. This portrayal refers to a meteorite falling near Alex's town on the 15th of September. 5500 and bit too fast made the other one on this uh, sculpture is a depiction of an abstracted rendering of revenge <laughs> this game just makes this stuff up it's hilarious is it worth buying an expensive advanced component that we don't know what anything to do with yet. It's $259 and I don't know what we need it for. Not yet. Yeah. It feels a bit too far ahead at the moment. Glitter World Medicine. And a kit of advanced ultrasight medical supplies, probably manufactured on distant Glitter World. It contains advanced polymorphic drugs, nanite diagnostic and healing aristas. What the heck? Glitter meds can be a lifesaver. Blimey. Do you have to have a certain skill level to apply them? Because they're actually quite cheap. Is it worth having, like, one in stock or something? They're not that expensive. Let's get a couple, put them in stock, just in case. So it's 731 down. Wait, when did we get the goats? Oh, that's them. A male and a female goat. We've got enough on with the pigs right now. The boost chance of surgery improves the speed of immunity if you're sick. Best save it for emergency. Exactly, that's why I'm thinking of buying just a couple of them. Luciferium, a concoction of... Me a concoction of mechanites that dramatically improve the body's functioning in all respects. Over time, it can even heal old scarred wounds or brain damage, though it cannot regenerate lost limbs. Unfortunately, 
Without the moderating effects of regular doses every five or six days, the mechanites lose cohesion, causing continuous berserker rages and eventual death. After the first dose, there is no way to get out the mechanites out ever. Wow. Talk about an addiction. Whew. That is bad. I just love the way they throw stuff casually on the ground somewhere. What if we grow minimum skill six? Smoke leaf. Can we not just grow that and sell it? Tinctoria, what the heck is that? Psychod plants, hot plants. You could sell roses. Heal roots. None of your hunters of the skill. Eight. Do five. We could do psychod plant for six. What does that do? Leaf plant generates chemical compound psychite. It's addictive. Tintoria. Oh, that's what you use for painting, is it? The color of walls. Making drugs is crazy profitable, it's drugs. Let's do it. So what's the best one, that psychoid plant? Make some psychotic drugs and sell them to the local tribes? Why not? Let's do it. If that's going to make money. Block the pores from taking the glitter world meds is set by default. The what? The pores. What do you mean the pores? Well, they're all, they're all on a no-drug policy, if that's what you mean. Everybody's on a no-drug policy, so they shouldn't take the glitter. I don't know why they would take the glitter world meds. How do we stop them? Second icon left. This one. Uh, best quality. So we just say, what, industrial? Do that. That do it. Cool. So otherwise they'll take the best one, which is that one, right? Gotcha. See, I wouldn't have known that. Oh, I've missed my cup of tea. Uh, smoke life is great for money. The joints can be sold to most vendor types. Is that the one we're growing? Smoke leaf. Are we better growing smoke leaf then or psychoid plant? Which is going to make the most money? This one has a higher skill level to sow, but we can do it. You turn psychoid into tea and sell that. And how do we make. How do we make. Do we need like a chemical plant or something? Am I now making something that I can't do anything with unless I research it? Probably. I probably need this, don't I? I probably need that. Yeah. 
Yeah, but drug production will allow her to create a drug lab. You need to research psycho. Smoke leaf doesn't require research. Okay, let's do smoke leaf then. So I don't need a drug lab for that. Is that correct? I can just make that without researching this. Cool. Let's do that. We need to make money somehow. <laughs> if their colonies want to smoke, that's fine. What on earth is going on here? Why are the muffalos in the compound? Oh, they're part of theirs, aren't they? I was about to shoot them. <laughs> Wait a minute. Can they... Do they know how to get out? They can walk through the doors, right? There's a real danger they're just going to walk this way. They'll avoid traps, we'll see. We will see. Alex is busy uh, hacking all this away. Unfinished steel simple helmet. He's actually making helmets. Look at this. Well, enemies can't Boeing. Like, the attackers won't be able to come through the door. It's only because they're visitors. This crafting's 12.56. Look at that. He's making, making stuff here. Trade caravan is leaving. Fine. Hey, Alex went and put a helmet on. He's like, I'll have one of them. So you can't see his armor on here by default, can you? I think there's an option for that. Gameplay interface. Weapons below portrait while drafted. Show them on names. They're not showing headgear, are they? Is that an option? Hide hats on UI. I'd like to see what they got. Uh, Notorious Mo, thank you for 49 months. D Duck, thank you for 75. Stepzilla, thank you for four. I'd rather see that they've got stuff. Not that you can see it, but I can see it. <laughs> I was gonna say, I just, I just looked up Alex and I was like, yeah, you can't actually see that. Um, which one would that be? No, 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 no. There you go. See. So trust me, they've got hats on. Did he get all that? Stargazing, really?
Is there nobody else but Alex that can mine? Seven skill. He's got seven as well. Playing horseshoes. Get down here. Let's get some free money. There's a cougar. Hmm. I'm making them work through the night. The Enceladus and Alex are both going to have really bad moods after this. Minus seven outside, but the clothes are keeping them warm. Look at that. That's pretty good. That male cougar is just like sleeping right next to the mining. Do you know what? Whoa, 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 whoa. We're about to be raided. Oh, there's three of them coming in. There's three. Let's have a look. Where have they got? He's got a short bow. Short bow and a short bow. I see pig food. I don't like you. Right, first of all, everybody can get drafted. Nobody's got the bow. Oh, that's because I had to move the rack, didn't I? So we can actually see the bow. And it still can't see the bow because it's not got weapons on it. Why did the bow not get moved? Ranged weapons. They should have been moved. It's too late for that now though, isn't it? That's that's really annoying. Hang on, one of them is incapable of um, violence, I think. That one. Boeing's incapable of violence. There's no point pulling him into the fight. But he needs to get back. Uh, a bit too fast shooting is on three. I don't know what's better, like a heavy bow or a pistol. I have no idea. Auto pistol. Right, you, 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 and you. Where are they going to attack, do we think? They might go here. Since the music just completely changes. Come on, don't be shy. We've left a gap in the wall. Please don't attack. <laughs> Get wrecked. Get absolutely wrecked. <laughs> like the first one died on the first trap. The second one died on the third trap. And then the other one got shot in the back. That was amazing. That was complete slaughter. Oh, man. Right, how do we... Um, we need to move them, don't we? Right, first of all, we can undraft everybody. <laughs> that was amazing. One's still alive. Oh, yeah. That's fresh meat for the piggy. What's your... What are you looking like? Let's see. A gunshot from an auto pistol... Wait, how did you manage to get stabbed? How to make pig food in less than three steps. That was amazing, bless you. How did they get stabbed? I didn't do that. What do you want? Can't click on this one. 
Oh, the trap must have stabbed them, look. It must be the trap, look. They got stabbed, and then their right tibia got cracked. And then their torso got absolutely wrecked. His spine got cracked. His pelvis got cracked. Oh, my God. He got absolutely wrecked. Right, well, they need... Wait, where did that come from? Did they drop that? Love that. <laughs> I'm thinking... Oh, do I have to rebuild them now? They're like a one-shot item. Can we just move these over here? I kind of want to... I kind of want to move them and then take their clothes off and then put them in the pig pen. They can have all sorts of things on them. Bleeding out in seven hours. There. Finish you off. What do you mean, draft first? What, you want... This guy sucks. This guy's got like an addiction to drugs. I don't want to keep him alive. Harvest the body part. No, I'm going to feed them to the pigs. That's the whole point. I'm going to strip them and drop them in the pig pen. Tough is a really good trait. Yeah. Smoke leaf dependence is not though, is it? Strip them and then finish them off. Right, strip them while they're still alive. Strip you. Strip you. She's only 19. <laughs> Purple locust, her name. Writhing around on the ground. Oh, like Benner and Enceladus just have a quick meal before they do anything. Like, really? Really, guys? Prioritize stripping buffalo. Benna. You can prioritize stripping locust. And who else is running away? Alex, get here. You can prioritize stripping that one. Yeah, the bows are rubbish, though, aren't they? That one's norm. Oh, Enceladus doesn't like this. Tired, minus 12. Observed a corpse, minus 6. I saw a dead body laying on the ground. It was disturbing. <laughs> Wait, you're running away. You're not even dealing with it. I can't believe it. What's Benna doing? Right, Boeing cannot finish off incapable of violence. That's why you let your psycho do it. That's true, actually. We should be getting Alex to do this. Alex can't do it because he needs to have a melee skill of six to finish them off. It's bonkers. In that case, then, you can just... Prioritize cleaning blood off buffalo and locust. Right, just haul him. Wait, there's smoke leaf joints here? We can sell that. Wait, what is Alex carrying? Oh, that is the body. Where's he going? Straight to the pig pen. Let's go, Alex. Uh, 
There we go. No, you're not getting away with that. Come back here. We've got more jobs for you, pal. Prioritize stripping. I'm hoping this one will die soon. Alex really wants to go to sleep. Look at this. In fact, his mood, look at his mood, is about to hit the um, critical marker. I think you are about to go nuts. You're about to have a mental breakdown because you're so tired. Uh, you're just going to bed, are you? Okay, he's like, yeah, I'm not doing that. I'm just going sleeping. By which point, this corpse will be rotted away. Who do we get to move it, then? Let's see if Banner can deal with it. Why does Bennett not like Bit Too Fast very much? Insulted? Oh, God. Bleeding out in two hours. Oh, God, yeah. It's, I, do you know what, Alex? I did not notice the time. That is insane. I did not notice the time. At all. <laughs> oh dear. Right, I'll be back in an hour, so I'll be back at quarter past four probably. We'll see how I get on. I don't want Mrs. Squirrels done for food. I did not see the time at all. I'm too engrossed in the combat. <laughs> all right, I'll be back in an hour's time when we shall clean up this mess. Hopefully Alex won't completely lose his mind because he's resting and uh, yeah we'll carry on planting stuff <laughs> thanks for watching guys see you in an hour if not uh, enjoy the rest of your Sunday evening I'll be back in uh, one hour's time from now that's it for me bye for now